Item number SCP-6387, Object Class Neutralized. Special Containment Procedures. SCP-6387's remains are currently preserved in Site-44's Biological Abnormalities Containment Wing, pending further study. Description. SCP-6387 was an anomalous humanoid neutralized in Virginia in 1923. Physically, SCP-6387 stood at 2 meters tall, with numinous eyes and thin translucent skin. Subject was hairless, with tapered ears and clovers, hoof-like feet, no reproductive organs present, SCP-6387's hands disproportionately large, each possessed four digits with protruding claws measuring six centimeters in length. Whether or not SCP-6387 was sapient remains unknown. SCP-6387 was first sighted in Oakland Cemetery on October 15th, 1923. Shortly after midnight, 50-year-old groundskeeper Joseph Rutledge awoke to the sound of an intruder. Initially suspecting grave robbers, Rutledge set out to investigate, whereupon he discovered SCP-6387 digging furiously at the site of a fresh burial plot. Startled, Rutledge shot SCP-6387 twice in the chest with a point thirty eight Smith and Weston revolver. Subject expired instantly with Watledge with Watledge later informing the civilian authorities. Agents embedded in the local police force subsequently alerted the foundation to suspected extra normal activity. SCP C three eighty seven remains were transported to Site forty four for research with amnestics administered to all witnesses. The grave targeted by SCP-6387 was exhumed and found to contain the remains of 24-year-old milkmaid Charlotte Abernethy, who was reported to have died following an epileptic seizure the previous morning. The casket's interior exhibited numerous prominent scratch marks. Cause of death was deemed Suffocation. Miss Abernethy was reburied without further incident.